Today I'm going to unbox one of my favorite mystery boxes that you can get. This is a mystery box, a subscription mystery box from the company Pro Wrestling Tees called Pro Wrestling Crate. So this is the October 2019 Pro Wrestling Crate. Each one of these will have two t-shirts, you'll have an autograph 8x10, you'll have a micro bra which is like a little vinyl figure which is extremely collectible, you'll have usually a DVD and at least one other like small little trinket or something, you know? So, I mean, the value of this thing is insane. I think the price point's around $35 plus shipping. Bigger shirt sizes will cost more by like two or three bucks. So, $35 for two t-shirts, just the t-shirts, pay for the entire box. Because most of these t-shirts, uh, ones like it, sold on ProRacingTees.com, sell so usually like 25 bucks a pop. So just, honestly, the, the two t-shirts pay for the entire box. And I buy these boxes mainly for the two shirts and the autograph. That's what I collect. And that's what I'm actually trying to go for, get out some cool stuff. And every month, Pro Wrestling Tees never lets me down with the Pro Wrestling Crate. They never let me down. Yes, there's been a few months here and there where you're kind of disappointed with maybe the style of the t-shirt or the autograph selection. Yeah, of course it happens. But the value in the Pro Wrestling Crate is insane. I buy these every single month I have now for couple years maybe maybe a little less than that so i'm always happy with it in the long run i'm always happy top of it we actually have the cheat sheet carefully look i don't want to, okay the other side so back of it has spoilers don't look this front one says this is called masks and paint 2 and of course uh, you know spoiler on our side next month's theme is staff favorites you've got featuring rick flair Bill Goldberg, Brutus Beefcake, Young Bucks, I love the Bucks, man, Jurassic Express, Jungle Boy at Luchasaurus, and Marco Stunt, Jurassic Express and AEW, that's a fantastic trio tag team, very, very fun, Joey Ryan and Flip Gordon, okay, next month's box, November box, is going to be insane, look at that lineup, though, who's going to be the autograph, honestly, I would love if they did the autograph of Jurassic Express, have a picture by sign by all three of them. How cool would that be? But more likely, that'll probably be a t-shirt. So I honestly look for the autograph to probably either be Brutus Beefcake or Flip Gordon. That's who will probably autograph be. T-shirt will probably be Ric Flair and probably Jurassic Express. Anyway, so done rambling. Here we go. First thing. We'll do a t-shirt. We'll do some other things then t-shirt and then autograph first t-shirt on top cool it's black i like my black t-shirts so uh just my color of preference when it comes to t-shirts i like black ones but i also wear dark colors dark navy grays heather grays stuff like that so i'll show you first what it is the shirt feels really high quality it's nice t-shirt who we got Oh, oh, yes. Last villain standing. Marty Scroll. Yes. So if you know Marty, he goes by, he's like the villain. And he actually is in the elite, but uh, he's under contract still by ROA, so he can't leave yet. This shirt's cool. It's like a Halloween theme shirt. You got Marty. Then behind him, you got other villains. That's kind of neat. You've got like... Uh, the Joker, you got Vader, you've got that one dude from uh, Harry Potter, whatever his name is, and then, who's that? Looks like a, a werewolf. And then the villain right there, look, kind of, it looks like Joffrey from Game of Thrones, but I don't think it's supposed to be Joffrey though. But that's a cool t-shirt though, I like that shirt. It's cool, I like it, I like it. So make sure it's the right size, yep. Man size 3XL. Okay. Next item. So that t-shirt right there, there's a $25 t-shirt. Let's see. Here we got a monthly pin. Oh, upside down. Chainsaw Charlie. I'm drawing a blank. Who is Chainsaw Charlie? 
Okay, sometimes whenever you record these boxes live, you'll have like brain farts that you just, your brain just can't function and pick out the filing cabinet in your head of what something is. I'm sure once I read the cheat sheet and I see this is, I'll be like, come on, Clint, you knew who that was. But Chainsaw Charlie, monthly pin, I'm just drawing a total blank of who that is. We'll figure it out. Here we go. And then we've got, oh, cool. We got a luchador mask. Now, this is, I think, the third mask I've received. I received one from Pro Wrestling Loot. I got one from uh, that wrestling club, which is no longer, they're out of business. They actually got bought out by Pro Wrestling Crate. And this is my third mask, a uh, luchador mask. Cool. Let's take this thing out and look at it. I know my last one is actually a luchador mask of Rey Mysterio. And that one's ultra cool. So there you've got the luchador mask. Very, very cool. Just in time for Halloween. Next. So that's actually kind of like one of the extra little things they throw in. Ultra cool though, you know what I'm saying? All right. Here we go. DVD. Oh. We've got Diva Diaries, Sue Young. Okay, I'm not really a big Sue Young fan. So, like this, I won't watch. Honestly, I'll probably just sell this thing. Not a fan of Sue Young. But, I mean, she's cool and all, but, eh. Not my cup of tea. Not everything in every box you're going to like. Some items you might not like. Like that, eh, you know. Where's the micro brawler? There it is. Oh, I remember. Last month, we we got Axe. This month, we got Smash. I remember it said last month, the next box will complete the tag team. So we got Axe, and we got Smash. So that's, that's kind of cool. I like that. So, uh, like, last month, I did not sell yet because I was waiting to get Smash and sell them together as, you know, a tag team. But, yeah, these sell for about, this one will probably sell about 15, 20 bucks on eBay. Let's see, there's something else that's soft. What's there's something so oh it's the <laughs> duh it's like there's something soft in here it's the other t-shirt clint come on think okay so this one is good this one this one is like a dark gray so at least it's not like a baby blue or something like that We've got a dark gray kind of like a heather t-shirt and i'll show you first who is it oh demon bunny Cool, Allie and um, Rosemary, right? Yeah, that's neat. Okay, I like that shirt. I like it. That's cool. Even though Allie is now an AEW and Rosemary, I think she's still she's still an Impact, right? I don't watch Impact, so I'm not hundred percent sure, but I think she's still an Impact, maybe. But yeah, that's a cool T-shirt. I like that. That's a, actually a pretty cool graphic. It's nice. I like it. Got your three XL. Yes, that is a cool. Actually, they're. They're actually severed heads, too. I just noticed that. Very Halloween kind of theme to it. That's cool. So we got one thing left. It is the autographed 8x10. I don't remember who was supposed to be in this box, so I couldn't even, I can't even guess who this might be. Try to make sure I pull it out. Okay, so you, you, you can see it, but I cannot see it. Who do we have? Oh, Glacier. <laughs> WCW icon. Glacier. Eh. Not really an autograph that I'm wanting. I mean, I'll keep it. I'll throw into my collection. Into like, it's like my binder of autographs that I really don't want. Um, yeah. Not a Glacier fan. Never really cared much for his in-ring work. He was actually at the StarCast 2 in Las Vegas, and he was signing for like 20 bucks, and I, you know, I passed right by him. I didn't really, you know, so autographs are let down, but you won't like everything in every box. Some autographs are phenomenal, and this one is just, eh. But with the inclusion of the mask, they obviously had to do a, a cheaper, of course, you know, he probably, they, you know, he probably gets paid like two bucks an autograph. He probably signed a thousand of them. But yeah, Glacier, yeah. He's which, of course, he was a straight ripoff of a Sub Zero by or from Mortal Kombat. I remember when he first came out in WCW, we we're all like, 
that's sub zero I, be original but yeah yeah so don't care for the autograph it's a downer but i love both t-shirts the main things i like are the t-shirts and then the autograph everything else just kind of throw in stuff but value wise this was still a crazy value t-shirts are 50 autograph honestly like 10 10 bucks value 60 80 you know throw in these I say it's probably worth a good $100 value box, so it was still fantastic value. Let's see, cheat sheet. We got, of course, the Marty t-shirt, decapitated bunny t-shirt, smash figure, matte classic lucha mask, glacier autograph, chainsaw Charlie exclusive collector's pin. I'm still, I'm still drawing a blank of who chainsaw Charlie was. The picture actually doesn't say. I'm drawing a complete blank of who chainsaw Charlie was. Brain fart. So overall box, it, it was good. It was good value. Once again, you got all your money back plus more. So if you're into collectibles, you got it. You like t-shirts, you got it. You like autograph, you got it. So I'll see you again next month with the next Pro Wrestling Crate. So it's going to be a good one. Remember all the names that I read you? Yeah, it's going to be a good one. I'll see you next time. I'm out. Perfect. Perfect.